Spring is still a couple of weeks away, but it's certainly going to feel like it this weekend, as Bruce just mentioned. And what better way to prepare than by going to the Connecticut Flower and Garden Show? Channel 3's Mike Cameron is live at the Connecticut Convention Center at Adrian's Landing in Hartford with a preview. Mike? That's right. In honor of Suffield here, we've got a beautiful garden. We've got Christy. You're the producer of this show. This is your show, right? Yes, I am the show producer. All right. And you also produce the grass we're on? Yes, we get the last cut of uh, sod before, around Thanksgiving, and we bring it up to our greenhouse, and uh, my husband and myself and uh, the folks that help us take care of it. So this is like near and dear to your heart. You're a farmer yourself part-time, right, in Connecticut? Yes. Yeah, yeah. So can you tell us a little bit about this year's show, how it's different than previous years? Why, if you've come last year or the year before? Where you should come this year. The gardens this year are top notch. They are spectacular. Uh, the Rose Society has done a wonderful job that we are sitting in, and really everyone has created fabulous gardens. It smells like spring, sounds like spring. It's really a wonderful show this year. A lot of water features this year. Yes, there are a lot of water. So it sounds like spring too. I mean, it just really gives you a, a a glimpse of what you can have in your own yard. And you got how many exhibitors? I have 23 landscape exhibitors this year. Okay. We have and then there are contestants too, correct? Yeah, so all of those folks that are in the landscape uh, have a friendly competition. And Best in Show was uh, Gresick Farms out of New Hartford. Right. Uh, another big winner was Sam Bridge out of Greenwich. So we really encompass the whole entire state as well. And so Connecticut Spring. Connecticut Spring, right. yes. <laughs> lots, to do, lots to buy here. There's food here, of course. Um, uh, novice gardens, gardeners, too, have done their thing. Lots to see here all weekend long. Uh, coming up next, I think we're going to be talking to that winner. Uh, and he's got, like, he put some flowers in a truck. It's really cool. So you'll have to stick around to see that. We'll see you guys.